The responsibilities of the State Debt Management Office include negotiation and management of bonds, facilitation of external and internal loans and other forms of state funding instruments, documentation and maintenance of the record of the state debt profile, including the reconciliation of figures with the Federal Debt Management Office and other relevant stakeholders. For the rating agency in debt management, Lagos DMO has scored an A and B+, plus, raising the state borrowing integrity high. Amortization schedules were adhered to, interest rates are favorable, bonds were recorded and reissued, facilities were renegotiated for lower rates, other project financing methods were duly exploited. The global pandemic has, however, thrown up more challenges that required better ways of delivering on its mandate. Hence, the retreat for the management of the agency with the team sustaining Lagos beyond pandemic. It is therefore against this backdrop that I wish to strongly encourage participants at this retreat to take full advantage of the opportunity provided by this forum as well as the standing quality of resource courses invited to improve your knowledge, skills and competencies as administrators and debt management professionals. The ability of the state government to manage its debt profile has provided more opportunities for more borrowing and access to bonds. Let me also inform you that we are in the process of securing another bond in the state to the tune of 185 billion, in all which is expected to fund various projects and replace the recall bond at lower rates. Over the years, we have had in one, two, three instances where we redeemed bond before maturity. It shows our management capability. Apart from raising unique financing for the red and blue lines, which will be delivered in 2023, the state has continued to restructure existing loans and ensure large savings. Fala Bolatijani, LTV News.